hi there students, to put out feelers. Okay, so to ask around about something, to investigate, maybe to watch for something, to try to find out something in an indirect way. But look, this will be much clearer if I give you some examples. Hey John, do, do you know anyone who might be interested in buying my car? And John says, well, let me put out some feelers and discover if anybody is interested. Okay? So, to find out, to ask around, yeah? To test the waters, if you like, okay? <coughs> so, John says he's going to ask around. He's going to investigate and try and find out if anybody is interested in my car. Okay, um, I'm looking for a job, a new job, because I want to change my job. So I'm putting out feelers to see if there's anything that might be available. Okay, so I'm exploring, I'm investigating, um, but in an indirect way, so that people don't really know what I'm looking for, okay? So, a feeler. A feeler is like the tentacle of an octopus, or maybe the antenna of an insect. And maybe, imagine this octopus feeling around for food with its tentacle. This is its feeler. So, it's putting out feelers to see if there's anything around to eat. Okay? So, when you want to do something new, maybe you put out feelers to get some information about it, yeah? To find out general information before going to do it directly, yeah? Maybe if you launch a new product, yeah? You want to put out feelers, you want to test other people's opinions before you make any decisions. Yeah? So you're putting out feelers, you're just gathering information before you actually make a decision. Yeah? So, to put out feelers, to gather information on something. Do you know any good English teachers? Well, let me put out some feelers and I will get back to you. Okay? So, there you go. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.